I'm just going to draw out just a, another box here again. Okay, so we're in uh, we're in sub patch mode right now. Now, the way to way to create sharper edges in sub D mode is that we need to create some extra geometry. If we wanted to take this perfect, uh, we wanted to take this box shape that turns kind of into a circle, and I wanted to create more of a square shape, but without using that uh, weights tool, this sub patch weight. Um, we're going to make some cuts using the uh, the knife tool. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go back in polygonal mode, and I'm just going to draw a line straight across, knife it again. Whoops, sorry, knife it again. Okay, and I'm just going to draw another one down here. Okay, if I hit the tab key now, notice that it's looking more like a more like a square now. Okay. Okay, so now it's it's coming. It's uh, see now, but notice if we zoom in on the edge or the corners, it's still a little rounded. Okay. So what we want to do to try to create a sharper edge. Okay, we're just going to use the move tool. And the way you create a sharper edge is you you make the uh, the points closer to each other. So the points at this corner, okay, are going to get closer to here to create a sharper edge. So we're just going to hit the T key, control to just constrain, okay? So now if you look up, you'll start to see how how much sharper that edge is, and the closer, I'm just going to try to get as close as we can. The closer we bring this over, the sharper, the sharper that's going to be. Now, um, if I want to get this a little bit sharper again, we're going to have to select these points right here. Okay, so we're going to zoom in. We're going to hit the T key. Okay, control to constrain and see how that just pops right up in there. Okay, so that's another way that you can uh, control the the edge of your uh, your polygon uh, in uh, in sub D mode. Okay, so so right uh, so what we're going to do now is I'm just going to show you how to make a shape. Um, combining a, um, a sharp edge like what we did with um, with that sub patch weight and, and mix it with uh, a smooth organic uh, smooth organic shape okay so just gonna make a box a couple boxes again um, Okay, and we're going to knife it. Just bear with me for a second. Okay. So, like I said, we're just we're just keeping it uh keeping it simple. So, if I want to make something like uh like a a doorway shape in uh sub D mode, okay? All I got to do is we're going to go back to our sub patch weight and we're going to go back to map we're going to go to weights okay so boom and boom okay now if we go to extrude now now in order to if we want to make uh, these a harder edge we're going to have to go in and do the same type of uh, maneuver with the sub patch but anyways this is just to give you an idea of, of how you can control the shape now if I want to create a more uh, rounded edge at the top for this door okay I'm gonna have to add another split down the center and then we're gonna add another one 
right across here. Okay, and then we are going to select these two points and bring them in. Bring this one up. Okay, so you've got these two hard edges here, and then all you have to do is just re manipulate points on the sides, and then you can you can create all the shapes you want. Okay, so you can combine sharp edges with um, with organic smooth smooth shapes.